Here with Lancaster University head football coach Mickey Joseph. We want to talk about National Signing Day. And coach, you really made a big impact right down the street at Guthrie High School. Yeah, we, we tried to get in gut, you know, since 08. Just get kids in there, quality kids up from there right now. But I think um, getting a, getting Lamar, that's, that's a start. And I think if they're in your backyard, you got to keep them in your backyard. And that's what we're trying to do. Tell me about Lamarck. Uh, he was obviously starting tight end for a 14-0 state championship team there at Guthrie. What did y'all see in him, and did it help that he had family that had attended Langston? It helps a lot when they have family that attended Langston, and also he's a big athletic kid that I think can come in and help us right away. Um, so I think once he comes in here, we see where he's at mentally with his football IQ on a college level, then we'll take it from there. Got a lot of big, big time names for in state going to Langston. You got a kid from Lawton, Lawton being in 6A, you know, that's the largest class in the state. And then uh, you got a couple other kids from a couple other schools that were knowable as well. Well, what we try to do, we try to make sure we have a, a get the good talent out of this state. I mean, if, if anybody don't know anything about Oklahoma, they do play good football here. You just got to find them. And I think that's what our staff did. They went out and found them. And it's a good recruiting class for us in state kids. Tell me about the Allstate signings. I know obviously is a big day at Allen High School down there in Texas. Well, we, when you talk about Texas, you talk about some of the top football in the United States. And Allen, Allen High School, you know, a team that been to the state championship, won the state championship. So to get four kids out of there, that really helps our program and boost our, you know, our morale when we're going down there to Texas to pick some of these kids out. Give me your thoughts as you was looking at the photos from the signing day. They're signed uh, right next to kids that went uh, signed with Alabama and Air Force and Arkansas Tech, schools of that nature. What is it like for Langston to have such a big impact on a school like Allen on signing day? Well, that's a big impact because one thing we tell our kids, you know, after you go to college four or five years, only thing you can lay down on the table is your college degree and how many rings you have. And I, that's one thing we're going to do here. We're going to graduate and we're going to win championships. Now, Coach, uh, obviously last year, your first year, you go 7-3, you're co-conference champions, and really you didn't have a whole lot of time to get a recruiting class in like you did this year. This is your first real recruiting class. So what does this do heading into the summer and getting ready for next fall? Well, it helps. It helps with depth. You know, we do have a um, number of kids that we registered last year that's going to be to help us in the fall. But we got they got to have a good spring. And with these freshmen coming in in the fall, they got to come in and have a good fall camp. We're not going to rush any kids to put them on the field. They're not mentally ready because we do have kids here already that's ready to go. But these freshman kids will bring some depth to us. Once again, this is head football coach Mickey Joseph of Langston University talking about Langston University's signings on National Signing Day.